Evil Cyan Quirrell, Evil Cyan Quirrell, Evil Cyan Quirrell. I'm going to speak to you about something. This morning, I got off from a phone call from someone's parents, and they were furious and worried because when he went home with a dozen of injuries to his body, his legs, his arms and his face, he started running away back home and feeling traumatized. That was Jake E. Anderson that you bullied him, beat him up and assaulted him. Why in bloody heavens would you do that to him? Because he said that he likes to go out to Dave and Buster's along with his family. So what? You could have just ignored him and his family about it, and it's his and his family's own opinions on what they all said about it. And I agree with Jake E. and his family. Dave and Buster's is actually the best place to go on field trips. You're a complete dangerous assassin to Jake E. Anderson, as well as his older sister Viley Anderson and her frenemies Andrew Orozco and his crew. You're coming with me to the principal's office right now. Andrew Orozco and Viley Anderson are not going to be extremely happy when I tell him all about this. Trixie Prank, what brings you into my office right now? And why is evil Cyan Quirrell in my office crying? Well Andrew Orozco, Viley Anderson, and Lucy Nickel, all three of you will not be extremely happy about this. Evil Cyan Quirrell just beat up, bullied and assaulted Jake Ear. Why? Because Jake E. said something about how he and his family like Dave and Buster's a lot. Oh, my, fucking, God. Evil Cyan Coral, that was just by love you for what you did to Jakir Anderson just because of his stupid opinions on Dave and Buster's. Yeah, you could have killed Jake E. for what you did to him. The doctors told me that he survived, but he needs to stay away from bad guys like you. You're a complete dangerous assassin to us because of that. Do you know what is next and what are we going to do to now? Oh no. All three of you are going to invite Viley's true and false families. That is what we're going to do right now. Stay right there and don't move a single step. Thank you guys for inviting us to this serious meeting. No problem Clarissa and Giselle Anderson. The rest of my true and false family couldn't make it to this meeting, so we brought in Jakinger with us. What has Evil Cyan Quirrell gotten into today Trixie prank? Well, to be honest with all of you, Evil Cyan Quirrell just beat up, bullied and assaulted Jake Ear just because Jake Ear said something about how he and his family like Dave and Buster's a lot. Evil Cyan Quirrell, you disgust us. Why would you bully, beat up and assault Jake Ear just because we all like Dave and Buster's? Do you actually know that you almost killed him? Oh. That's not only that evil Cyan Quirrell did this, but he also pulled up a scary prank that got the spies of heroes and the rest of my squad traumatized, and caused a lot of victims to be traumatized for life when he actually went out on a crime spree along with Nikita Gaming 71. I am actually going to expel that bastard Nikita Gaming 71 for going out on a crime spree. Here are the consequences that evil Cyan Quirrell will be getting. Tomorrow. He will be serving one consecutive semester of detention, he will be serving 100 years of community service, and he will no longer attend the end of the year trips for the rest of his life. No. Please don't give me all of those. And to be honest with all of you, I was looking forward to the end of the year field trips. Can't things get easier when I go outside easily? Nice try evil Cyan Coral, you're one of the worst enemies I ever had just like Viley Anderson. We have to agree what Andrew Orozco said. And another thing, need I mention to tell you that you sickened five creatures with a fake lockdown that you made? That is just straight up nasty and cruel of you. You will be sued for fifty, thousand, dollars, for traumatizing all of us. I just simply cannot take the pressure and cannot stand about your fucked up behavior for what you did to Jake Earing to all of us you evil Sam Quill. How fucking dare you hurt Jake Ear's feelings and then go out on a crime spree along with your goddamn friends and caused a lot of victims to be traumatized for life. What you did to the victims was a serious crime of multiple degree murders. That is so fucking it right now. You are grounded for the rest of your life. Go to your room and think about how many victims you have traumatized. 